Earlier this month, we brought you a story about brain tumor awareness and how to spot signs that something might be wrong. Now, most of the time, a brain tumor is ruled out, but that wasn't the case for Pasco physical therapist Kyle Bonin. A strange symptom led him down a long road from the initial diagnosis of a brain tumor to his continued rehabilitation. From running marathons to relearning how to walk, Dr. Kyle Bonin's life was turned upside down by the diagnosis and treatment of a brain tumor. Cancer's terrible because sometimes you can't prevent it. In 2009, Bonin started experiencing double vision. I had no idea what was going on, so we went to some doctors, eventually got an MRI. MRI showed that there was a brain tumor. Due to the location, we couldn't do anything about it. So we just watched it for several years. Then the tumor started to grow and action needed to be taken. The tumor was removed, but the surgery damaged his brain. So I went from running, I even worked out the morning before the surgery because <laughs> I was nervous, you know, they're going to cut my brain. So how do you de-stress? Exercise. And then, you know, I woke up and I couldn't exercise, couldn't sit up, couldn't get to the toilet by myself afterwards. Nearly 10 years later, he's still on a journey to recovery. And I still have the double vision, um, so I can't catch anything. Someone throws me something, I can't see it, track it visually to catch it. Um, my depth perception's bad, so like when I'm going downstairs or stepping off a curb, I go a little slower. Um, I'm very self-conscious of it because we're all self-conscious of our own things. Now he's helping others get on their feet as clinic director of Peak Physical Therapy in Pasco. It gave me a lot of empathy for my patients because, you know, they're coming at, to me at their lowest point in life. You know, they're in pain, they used to be so active and now they can't. You're not old, not until you're at least triple digit age are you old. He works to keep his patients optimistic through humor. I actually sit back down, I'm sorry. Ah, stand up. <laughs> and getting them moving again. His advice to anyone with suspicious symptoms. You always want to get it checked out, see a health professional. Um, wanting things to go away and ignoring doesn't make it better. According to Bonin, peak physical therapy provides free screenings, which could help determine if you're simply in need of physical therapy or if there is a need to see a physician.